My name is Anupam Goyal. I'm a general internist and I'm the chair of the board of directors for Direct Trust. I've got two great speakers here with us to talk about this in more detail. I'll let them introduce themselves. Lisa, let's start with you. Hi, my name is Lisa Nelson. I'm a medical informaticist from MaxMD, and I'm interested in how direct is being used to further interoperability in our communities. Thanks, Lisa. Teresa? Hi there, I'm Teresa Bell. I sit as the president and CTO of No2. Uh, also share the same passion that Lisa has for the use of direct messaging and seeing it evolve in the community. Uh, and also just delivering better care and bringing interoperability in a meaningful way to healthcare. I serve as the chair for the event notifications uh, consensus body and excited to see this come to life. Thank you both. What are the benefits of using direct to meet the CMS ADT notifications condition of participation? I see it as a huge opportunity to ride in the tailwind of the largest network in the United States. Everybody with meaningful use, we saw every certified EHR from 2014, 2014 certification and on, implement direct messaging, the use of direct messaging, and that fabric has been laid across the United States. And the directory has been established to utilize these communications. So there's never been a better time, a better technology, to meet technology where it's at in healthcare and, and take advantage of the tailwind that the standard has already created, improve it a little, and now see it really take off and, and the use of direct really have an impact on healthcare. Direct is perfectly positioned to um, make impact on this, on this problem. It is push technology that is exactly what is needed to deliver an event notification. So this is an opportunity to put something that's positioned not only to, um, to meet the, the information exchange needs, but also it's perfectly positioned because it's payload agnostic. We have the opportunity to make the message that's delivered um, fit the most sophisticated technological user who's going to have an automated um, workflow that can take advantage of machine process information all the way to uh, the simplest user who just simply will get the human readable notification of this and take action based on their, uh, their, their manual workflows that they have. So this is an opportunity that direct trust is perfectly positioned to help the industry make progress with. And I think to Lisa's Thank point, we're, again, we're meeting technology where it's at, but it's also with this implementation guide and just a few modifications to the direct implementation, we have also future-proofed. So the kind of the, the future is unlimited as to where direct can go. We're going to start with event notifications, uh, but the opportunity to use it for things such as out-of-range lab results, there's just the opportunities are endless with, with just a few modifications to improve the in infrastructure and uh, see this where this takes us in the future. I want to thank our speakers for coming today to give us great information about this new ADT notifications and how Direct Trust can help solve that issue. Lisa, Teresa, thanks again. Thank you. Our pleasure. Thanks for inviting us.